This is the part two of the Phoenix. We are reviewing the content and illustrations inside the book. Mm. The dead come back. Mm. Okay. So let's see. This one looks like Greek, right? Hmm. Look at the painting. Yes, it does. And they have an urn and they are stirring it. Mm -hmm. Whatever's in the urn. So. And that's a brazier burning herbs, perhaps. Mm -hmm. wow. hmm. So they're obviously doing something magical. Guard or four is an electric spark photograph by its own light. Hmm. Oh, nice. Okay, everybody oh, knows yeah. this. Albert Pike. Yep. And really, Perry, Albert oh, Pike, yeah. the Plato of Mace Freemasonry. The Master Builder. And this one is, In what is this? Is this a certificate or what? House of the Temple of the Supreme Council. It's Mason. It's a masonry. Yeah, it's on formal masonry letterhead. Masonic. Yeah, 33 lodge. degrees. Yes. In Deo Fiduca, Fiducia Nostra. In God, mm -hmm. what is Fiducia? Ah, uh, trust. I don't know, nostra. Uh, our, our in Latin, like our. Well, well. fiducia, fiducia. Uh, the etymology oh, it, would be fiduciary. You know what? I haven't seen an, a younger picture of Albert Pike, but mm. look at this. Mm -hmm. He's young here. And Albert Pike composed a poem. Life is a count of losses every year. Lost springs with sobs replying unto weary autumn sighing while those we love are dying every year. Very positive. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, you know this. A yogi who sits in the air. Mm -hmm. Oh, example of levitation is practiced by wonder workers of India. So tell me about this uh, sitting in the air. Well, uh, I typically do it for two or three hours a day. <laughs> I don't know anything about it. Okay. <laughs> other, other than it's called a siddhi, a power. Siddhi. So making the body extremely light, that definitely is something that, oh, in uh, perhaps uh, Indian tantrism, but in yoga, you can find lists of siddhis or powers, extraordinary powers, and levitation is one of those. Whether it's true or not, I, I couldn't attest to myself, but... Uh, Skywalking adepts. Mm-hmm. The fabled wonder workers from the snowy range. The Himalaya. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I've heard the Tibetans are, are known to do some Here, pretty miraculous things, too. The Buddhists. So. The snake charmers. Mm-hmm. Okay, is the snake charmer from India or from Arab? Or both? Well, when they use the king cobra, I think the king cobra snakes are more indigenous to India than the Arab world. Mm -hmm. uh, there's some crossover, of course, in uh, what's now well Iran, but that's Persia. But India, that's a short answer. The body in the basket trick. Mm. Is this Moses? <laughs> ah. Enter the magician. Australian artist Norman Lindsay. Hmm. Miraculous mango tree. It looks Asian again, Oriental. Mm -hmm. Concentration and retrospection. Yeah, and that's the Himalaya. Oh, that's the Himalaya? Oh, yeah, definitely. What's this? Melancholia? Oh, I think I know this. It looks almost looks like an engraving by Drurer. I'm not sure if it yeah, is. Yeah, you're right. Let's see. It, it right. is, it is you're actually. Right. From the celebrated engraving by 
Albrecht Drur. I hope you like and enjoy the review of the Phoenix. Thanks for watching. Please like this video and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.